think so. Okay. <laughs> she owns the exact same outfit as her GTA character. <laughs> that's what she said. She oh, okay. <laughs> oh, man, that's classy. All right. Hello. Oh, thank you, Mom. Thank you. You want that in the recording? That's okay, right there. Oh. And you are ready, Jordan. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, well, we're kind of... Oh, we only have one. No, that's fine. We're kind of doing a video right now. Thanks for rooming. How's it going, everybody? My name is Jordan, Asian Power One, or Dak, and I'm here with Elijah. <laughs> yep. Hey! We're, <laughs> we're doing a QA, guys! Was that loud? I don't know. That was pretty loud. Oh, well. So, he's going to be interviewing me, and. Yep. I have a problem with being off, so. Forehead reveal. Age reveal? Oh, is this the age reveal too? No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not, not, gonna gonna not until Lexi's 24 hour live stream. Alright. Good deal. Good deal. What gender do you identify as? I sexually identify myself as an angel. I've always been this since I was born. Alright, is your dig out for Harambe? Okay, my dig out is only for three things. Harambe, Crush, and Charlotte. Oh. I know. Who's your favorite YouTuber? Who? I don't really watch much YouTube. To be honest with you, like the streams are the only thing I watch now. <laughs> so really, it's just Lexi, uh, Lexo and Rose. Shout out to them. Ah. James asks, "Can we still keep it PG?" <laughs> uh, not here. <laughs> not here. I'm very vulgar. Ooh. But yeah, we can still keep it PG. Lexa wants to know, what did you do when the Fire Nation attacked? I vanished. A hundred years passed. And my brother and I discovered a new mod. Asian. Probably sitting outside the door. For a hundred years he sat outside the door. And he just sat there, waiting for me. A hundred years, I just saw the wind under the door. A hundred years yeah, passed. A hundred years. And then a hundred years got to back. Oh, God. Really wants to know, at what age did you realize how much you love music? Oh, okay. Um, I, uh... I started producing music at like 13. That's because whenever uh, my brother and my cousin started rapping, so I decided to like, you know, give them beats. They were really crap, but I mean, <laughs> there was something. I think I think that's when I decided I was I was gonna do music. And now all the rest of these are from Kobe. Oh great! All on you. Well, 17 though. Mm. So where'd you get the name Asian Power One from? <laughs> Two W's, three A's, one one. Like the number. Okay, so I was creating my PlayStation account. Don't know why I, I couldn't come up with a name at all. So what I did was um, I wanted to do something that would represent me, so it's an Asian. And I needed something that no one else would ever have. So that's power. And it looked weird without a number, so I put one. Who's your favorite artist? Mm. And what is your favorite song by him slash her? And that comes from like a variety of people. Mm. I don't have one specific um, artist to listen to. But I do listen to like um, people who not many people listen to, like Steez and uh, Emilio. Yeah, 
Jesus. Really old. <laughs> um, definitely them. I, I definitely bumped in them. I thought somebody could be in there, you know. Ivan, definitely Ivan. And then um, I would go with like big people like Logic and Kendrick and J. Cole. And then I'm, I'm just a big hip hop fan. <laughs> and, um, but like rock, I definitely uh, go with Alter Bridge again. I haven't listened to them in a while, but... I haven't listened to them at all, actually. Oh, they're so good. Check, we should probably check them out. Definitely. But I'm not going to get copyrighted, so not now. Oh! Oh! I put in that one, but look at this one. Oh. Hey. Breaking Benjamin? Oh, man, I love Breaking Benjamin. You can cut their songs, by the way. Call their songs? Okay, so... Not specifically Breaking Benjamin, but... Okay, well, I'm going to say... Um, from Logic, I'm gonna go with Man of the Year from Logic. Oh, that's a good one. Steve, I don't know. <laughs> I can't really pick from Steve. Let me pull some Steve's up for you. Oh, man. Mm. Get a group. I don't want to miss you. Mm, definitely, definitely, I don't want to miss you. But I can't help it if I do. Don't, don't do it. <laughs> I'm not trying to cry yet. I'll be honest, synthetic memories is like one of my like. I think about you. I'm about you. About you is good. I'm about you. I'm talking about Ivan. You're talking about Ivan? I'm talking about Ivan. You don't do a million right now? Oh, you want me to do a million? I mean, I, that's, I just named off four million songs. Oh, whoops. I mean, you can talk about Ivan too. Check um, him out on SoundCloud. Yeah. His whole like Layers of Reflection album. Yeah, that one. That one was great, but. I guess I'll just say too cold. Too cold? Too cold. I'm cool. all about that bang. Oh, we got the Emilio. Yeah. I think I need by himself. Like that's my favorite song from by himself. Really? Yeah. That's. I'm not gonna argue with you. That's really good though. Like all his. So these three rappers in general, there's like no bad songs with them. Yeah. Like they might have a song that's like, eh, but that's rare. Like one in a like. One in a million, they will find something like that. I mean, Kendrick, we, can, we can stop if you want. Kendrick is uh, King Kunta. Off to that all the time. Or I. 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 I is good. And J. Cole, something from Porn Center. That's all. That's all I'm gonna say. I gotta say my two are Wet Dream and She Know. But um, I threw some of the 2014 Four So Dry, so that's no role model. Oh, uh, no. And then yes. Um, Alter Bridge, Coming Home is my favorite from them by far. <laughs> Breaking Benjamin. Uh, Dance with the Devil. Yeah. You dance with the Devil? No, break, from Breaking Benjamin? That's my favorite song. You dance with the Devil? Apparently, my. What made you think you start writing? What made you think to start writing? Basically, what made you start writing? English class. <laughs> All right. To be quite honest, with you, English class, and I realized how good I was, and like, I I don't like doing fake anything, so I kind of just let emotions go. What is one thing you did that seemed terrible, but oh my god, that voice crack. <laughs> What is one thing you did that seemed terrible ended up for the better? Hmm. I don't really have an answer to this though. That's the thing, cause like, ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, I don't have an answer to this, cause everything that I do, I do full on. Like, I have complete faith in whatever I'm gonna do. Full raging. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I mean, yes. What is something you would go back and change if you could? This one can get really deep. <laughs> Extremely deep. Mm. If I could go back and change? I feel like the both of us, like this could be... I don't think I would change anything. Make or break. I'm not gonna change anything. I like where my life is right now. Yeah, after like all the stuff I went through, I like my life right now. I love it right now, actually. You right. Where do you see yourself in 20 years? 20 years. Uh, let's see. Well, 
I don't know. Honestly. Probably with a family, because I'll be like, what? Not going to say my age. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll, I, I picture myself with a family. Probably not retired from making music, but like... I don't picture myself do making music forever. I'll be honest with you. Yeah. I can't. There, there's so there's so much you can do. With yeah. the kids. There's not gonna be much originality anywhere. Mm -hmm. Once it gets to a certain point, it's just all gonna sound the same. Like, that's why everyone cool. hates like EDM. That's why everyone hated rock. That's why everyone hated rap. That's why everyone hates like all these genres because like they all sound the same to that person. But eventually, music is just all gonna sound the same. Yeah. It's like a um, literary vampire. What's the worst and best thing you have done in your eyes? <sighs> no. Okay. Um. Making her whole cake. Um. Best thing I've done definitely has been coming to the streams. By far. Yes. Like I say, like this is the best thing I've done. But like those streams, like made everything positive and. Anyways, this is unprofessional. I'm eating. <laughs> Trying to answer. Okay, we pulled stuff out of our clothes. Yeah, that's true. Anyways, yeah, these streams made everything more positive and made me think more of myself in a way. Like I, I do have self low, like low self esteem, but like it's not as low now. Oh yeah. Not for but I don't, I don't know, the worst, I, I can't really say the worst things because I'll probably like, break down. It's too personal. Maybe a story from another time. So, Nikki wanted to know from Discord how long Jordan has been in the U.S. for. I moved to the U.S. when I was two. So, since I was two. Almost enough to review. <laughs> but not yet. 24 hour stream from Lexi, you will do it. Yeah. She also wants to know what's your favorite thing to do in your free time? <laughs> what free time do I have? <laughs> okay, um, when I was a kid, I used to play basketball a lot. The streams? The streams, I, that's practically like my job now. I, well, I, not really my job. Well, it's like more would you call it a job if you enjoy it? That's more of a career, actually. A career is a job that you enjoy. Then my it's my career. I make music. <laughs> I can, yeah, that, that's the that's the only thing I can I can really do. That's the only thing I remember you doing as a kid was basketball. You tried art as a kid. I did. I did do art for a little bit. I did play piano. I did dance for a little bit. I did taekwondo. <laughs> Next question. I guess I'll read it for myself. Uh, Mickey asks, "What is your favorite game to?" Ah, oh, dang it. <laughs> Mm. What is my favorite game to play? Mm. Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time. I knew you were going to say that. It's hot. I knew it. It's hot. So now it's into the album questions. Mm. So what is the name for the album? The name of the album is Welcome to Eternity. Alright, and then the follow-up question from that is why and where did you give slash get the name for that? Okay, so... The, uh, the name, oh, that's actually the name of a song I did back in like 2013. Yeah. Actually, no, not 2000, uh, 2014. That's when I actually started using the EDM. And, um, so, um, yeah. First song on the album. Review! <laughs> uh, where? I don't, I think I was just asking for suggestions and then I was like, you know what? I think this sounds really, this, this sounds really chill. It does. And like mixed with the. What the fuck is that? There's a net on my nose. It's also the fact that like it's my very first album, so I gotta. gotta welcome. Since I welcome everybody in the streams, I gotta welcome everybody to. my domain. I've been here for a while. Which song is your favorite of this <laughs> album? Uh, the one that's on this album right now. No, not the ones that are. That you were thinking about. Hmm. When the album comes out, which it will, on my birthday, this Thursday, September 1st, happy birthday to me.
But really? so the second the second song on the album was probably going to be my favorite because it pays homage to yeah, it pays homage to a, a good old group of mine. Good old uh, that group. It's great. Which do you think is going to be the best of them all? Oh, uh, uh, third song. That's all I'm saying for right now. You'll know once you get my album. Thursday. Thursday. September 1st. What kind of feelings will this album be inflicting such as sadness or getting hyped, etc.? What kind of feelings? Yes. Chill. Very, very psychedelic and chill. That's all this album is. It's something for you to think about. And it's also something to like, you know, whenever you're like having like a, like, I don't know, when you're like stressed out, you can like listen to this song oh, and go to, go to sleep and like, you know, feel, I'm trying to make you feel at least relaxed. I've done that multiple times. On the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being serious. Alright. <laughs> I've sat on the toilet listening to this and then just instantly just everything. <laughs> Why would the listener want this album? Wouldn't you? Okay, for okay, so since for one thing, it's my first album. Second thing, um, when it gets released, upon release, it'll be free for one hour. So, free music for one. <laughs> yeah, for one, or free. Second, it's my first. Um, after that album, it's gonna be eight dollars. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, it's kind of expensive, but ten songs. I mean, you're, you're paying for ten songs plus a bonus. He said eight. Originally, I said ten. I'll be honest. Yeah. I was, I was, I was he he would have made me more uh, greedy, I'm, but I'm not. I don't value money. Sometimes I'm like a really good marketer, and then other times I'm just like money, money, money. That's very that's very rarely though. But when it comes to like music that's like this good, I was like that's gotta be like at least ten. Yeah. But eight, even then, that's still really that's like that's the best price actually. With enthusiasm. <laughs> Will people be able to relate to why this album was created? With enthusiasm. With enthusiasm. This album was created so people can chill out and relax. So, if you feel like relaxing, then yes. So, this is the last question we have. Mm -hmm. Will there be a new album? Anytime soon. <laughs> no. Yeah, that, that no, dude. <laughs> Look, I, I know that I, I produce music a lot, but I have a lot of unreleased stuff. Some that I don't even think is finished. Some I don't even want to even put out. I don't think I can create an album just yet. After after this, maybe like in like six months after this album. I think that, that would be the fastest time, if, if anything. He's actually real bomb as fuck, by the way. Yeah, I know. I have him. That's too much. <laughs> that was the uh, Q&A, that's all the questions I had. Thanks for asking and watching. Um, shout out to Elijah for one thing, definitely. He came out and asked these questions, so I didn't have to ask myself these questions. I would have been... Oh! That's okay. Shout out to Lexi. Shout out to Lexel. Shout out to Rose. Shout out to all the people who answered, asked these questions, like Black Toast, Cody, Nikki, uh, Lexel. James. James, yeah. Keep it PG. Okay, so again, my album's coming out this Thursday, September 1st, at midnight. It's going to be free for, I think, under 200 people. I'm sorry. But that's as much Bandcamp gives me at first, until I get like a thousand downloads and buys and stuff. But, yeah. September 1st, free for the first hour on midnight, central time, but... I'll leave a link in the description so you know uh, what time, like, uh, what exactly that time is in your time zone. After that hour is up, it's gonna be eight dollars. Why eight dollars? Eight's my favorite number. Plus, it's, it's cheaper than paying for each song individually. And um, if you turn eight horizontally, it makes infinity, which is a synonym of eternity. 
I just made that shit up. <laughs> that was... Alright, well, you have anything to say? Um... It was fun. It was fun, actually. I, um... We weren't very professional. No, we weren't. I, was, I expected this to be like a, an interview. Like, I'd be only looking at you, but I instead looked at it over yeah, here. We were, like, <laughs> we were doing like all kinds of things. But I kind of did expect that, considering the fact of how our friendship is. We're not serious no, like, together ever, at all. <laughs> Never. Like, Unless we're in like deep in conversation. Oh That's, my god. Three o'clock in the morning. Gotta end the video. Nothing else to say? Try my mom's angles. Try my grandma's chili dogs. <laughs>